hi guys welcome to my channel welcome to my first ever video i damn it i'm so mad because the first time i did this it worked and it wasn't recording <laughs> anywho so for my first video i asked my friends on instagram what it should be about and a lot of people suggested to do a thrifting vlog because i love to go to the thrift store and i just wanted to share a few tips on what i do when i go to the thrift store tip number one is when you go to the thrift store any thrift store you go to most of the times they do have sales so the first thing you want to do is just scope out what sale they are or there is i like to take a picture because then sometimes i forget so you'll see right here is the sale sign and everything except for the white tag was 50 percent off Okay, so tip number two is definitely patience. You have to have patience when you go to the thrift store because you do have to go through the racks. Take your time browsing for stuff because if you just go in there and like go like that, like you're not gonna find any good deals. Tip number three. If you can, definitely try on the things because a lot of the times, actually I think like most of the times, you cannot return stuff at the thrift store. And sizes vary just like in all types of clothing. So just because it looks like it's your size, it might not fit. So I would personally suggest if you can to try it on. Okay, so tip number four is check the tags. And what I mean by tags is like the clothing tags. Because I am a really picky thrifter. Like, I don't like clothes that's stained. I don't like clothes that's really old. Um, and if you do, hey, there's no problem with that. But I'm just really picky. Um, so usually I'll look at the tag on the shirt and I can tell if it's like been really worn or whatnot. If I'm gonna get jeans that I plan to like rip up or anything like that or DIY, I really don't care. So, okay, I really think that's it. I mean, it's not much to it. You just go, preferably if you don't have kids, don't take your kids. I mean, I have an eight month old baby and I still take them with me, but if I could, I would go by myself because and at this exact moment my niece walked in okay so now i'm just pretty much gonna show you what i got um we did do like a little try on haul for you mario is just mario if you know him you know him if not this is mario so i got him this shirt because he likes the california flag um this one was 7.99 no sale hopefully you guys can And he got this jacket funny story he actually got a jacket like this in la that has the kangaroo pocket right here and he sent me a picture and first of all that jacket was ugly af but i asked him how much he paid for it and he told me he paid 35 dollars. and i was like shaking my head because i'm like we could thrift that thing for way cheaper so he got this one which is also a kangaroo jacket and this was 5 dollars it doesn't have the tag anymore, but I know it was five nineteen. So it's raining. Oh, no way getting wet. Stop that. Nothing will have to buy now. Don't shit like that. <laughs> then he got this um it says the shop and then this one was $2.99 the shop where'd you work work at the shop this one was $1.99 and he didn't even wear it on Christmas and I was like now we have this shirt that I don't know what we're gonna do Kevin. 
Christmas. Grandma going over by my reindeer. And then I just got three things for myself. Oh, I'm missing a shirt. So I got this jacket and it's totally giving me like 90s vibes and I know that's super in right now. So I love it. And then this one was $7.99. When I'm thrifting, I like literally really think about like if I want something or not. Like there was this Levi's jacket that I you'll see me like look at it in the video and it was $20, but I'm just like, oh, like I know it's Levi's, but I just couldn't do it. And now like looking back, I regret it because Mario just got a Levi's jacket and we got it on Amazon and it was $70. And I'm just like, I wish I would have gotten it. Okay, I also got this shirt. This one is for me. And um, this is actually for the men's section and this was only $3.99. So I think with this one, I'm either gonna do it in a knot or I'm gonna crop it. I'm not sure yet. But I really, really, really liked it because I have some black like um, faded jeans and I think it's gonna look so good. And then the last thing I got for myself was this um, Fruit of the Loom. And I haven't been even saying any of these brands, but I mean, I don't think anything is really name brand. But it's this Fruit of the Loom. And I'm pretty sure this sweater is new. And it's like this really, really pretty orange copper color. And this was $4.99. And this one, for sure, for sure, I'm going to be cropping. So it gives it like that raw crop top look. And then I just got a few more things. So we're gonna be going to Big Bear next month. Or actually by the time you guys see this, it'll be this month already. So I just found some things for my little baby. So I got this little hat for him. It's gonna be freezing. And this one was $1.99. And then I got these little gloves, which I don't think are gonna fit him, but it's okay because I got him a different pair. And I want to say that these were $1.99 as well, but I don't know what happened to the tag. I also got him this one. It's a little snowsuit, but I'm thinking it might be too big for him because I think it's 18 months and he's definitely not that size. And this one was $7.99 and it was the only thing that I got with a different color tag, with a yellow tag. So this one was actually $4 because it was 50% off. So that's actually pretty much all the clothes that I got. Um... I did get one last thing. I got this Scrabble game, which I'm so excited because I love Scrabble. And it was $5, but it's brand new. It's never been open, so you know none of the pieces are missing. Okay, so that's pretty much it for my little thrifting vlog slash tips. Um, I love thrifting, so I'm always going to be thrifting, so you're definitely going to see more videos. But definitely let me know in the comments down below if you want to see like kids thrifting ladies or men's also let me know if you guys want to see how to diy thrifted clothes because i would love love to hey do guys, that thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe i'm definitely going to try to post at least once every week um but you're definitely going to be seeing a lot of cooking a lot of thrifting uh probably diys and maybe some challenges with mario but